Today we'll be working on the front panels for our sun-kissed crochet along. So both of the panels, our right and left, begin the same way. So you're going to work them up the same way until you get to the sleeve portion. So let's begin by putting a slip knot on our hook and we'll chain 42. And just chain as many as you need to for the size you're working okay. on. I've chained 42 and now we're going to work single crochets across. So in the second chain from the hook, so we're working this just like our back panel, except it's smaller. So when you work across, you should have 40 one single crochet stitches and we'll chain one and turn work a single crochet in the first stitch and we'll be working single crochets all the way across so again we've got a total of 41 stitches for our small to large size but just follow along with the size you're working on in the pattern. Just working that across, now I'm going to chain one and turn. Our first row is just slightly different from our gauge swatch, so I'm going to work through that with you. So we'll work one single crochet in the first single crochet. I've chained one already there, and a single crochet in the next. Chain three. We're going to skip three stitches, one, two, three, and work our chain three V stitch. So work a double, chain three, and then work a double crochet in the same stitch. Now we'll chain three, skip three, one, two, three, work one single crochet in each of the next three. Chain three, skip three, one, two, three, work our chain three v-stitch, so a double, chain three, and a double, chain three, and we're just repeating this, so skipping three, working three single crochet, and just work that all the way along your piece, and I'll meet you up at the end. And as we get to the end, you should have five stitches remaining. I've chained three, we'll skip three, and single crochet in the final two. So that's how your panel for your back and your front begin. And now we'll pop up the gauge swatch stitch pattern so that you can complete rows two through seven. So now we're moving on to row two. And we're gonna chain one and turn. We're gonna work one single crochet in the first stitch. Then we're going to chain three. One, two, three. And now in 
our chain three space here. This is like a V and we've made a space. We're gonna do seven double crochet. Okay, so I worked through that fairly quickly. So there's seven double crochet in there. Now we'll chain three and we're gonna work a single crochet in the single crochet that's in the center. So we skip the first one, work a single crochet in the next. Oops. And then we chain three. And now in our next chain three space, we're gonna work seven double crochet again. Okay, so now we're finishing up and we're going to chain three and in the last single crochet we're going to do a single crochet okay and now we're going to chain six and we're going to turn So now what we're going to do is work single crochets in every DC of our shell. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And now we're going to chain five and we'll work single crochets across the next shell. So seven single crochets. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And to finish off here, we're gonna chain two and we're gonna work a treble crochet in that final single crochet. So yarn over twice, going through the single crochet. So now this is how it's looking. So now for row four, we're gonna chain four and we're going to turn and now we'll work a double crochet in that same space so we've made a little v here now we'll chain three and we're working only three single crochets through the center so we're skipping the first two singles working three one two three and then you should have two singles on the other side that we're skipping. Now we're going to chain three and then we want to make another V here and we're going to do it in the center of the chain five. So we need to skip over two of the chains and in the third chain we're going to work a double crochet. Let's push that through the chain double crochet, chain three, one, two, three. Then going back into that same chain, we're working a double crochet. So this is setting up that next shell that's gonna be in the center of these shells. Then we chain three and we're working three single crochet. So we're skipping two singles. And in the next three singles, we'll work a single in each. 
we'll chain three. And you just look at the pattern we're doing. So in this big chain space here, we're doing a V. So we're working a double, chain one, and a double. So these V's on the ends, but they only have one chain in them as opposed to three that's in the center. And now for row five, we'll chain three. And we're gonna do a half shell in this space. So we're gonna work three double crochet and our chain three is counting as one of those doubles. Okay, so there's our half shell made. We're gonna chain three. And in the center of our three single crochets, we do one single crochet. One, two, three, we chain three again, and now we're doing our full seven DC shell in between here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll chain three, one, two, three, and we do our single crochet down here in the center of our three singles. Chain three, and we're doing a half shell, so we're gonna do four double crochet in that final V stitch. So one, two, three, Four. Okay, and now we'll chain one and turn on to row six and we're back to doing our singles on top of the shells. So we'll work a single crochet in the first four stitches here. And then we're gonna chain five to get over to the next shell. So one, two, three, four, five. Skip over and work a single crochet in each of those double crochets. So a total of seven. And chain five to get over to the next one, two, three, four, five. And single crochets. So we have three doubles here. One, two, three. And then we have that chain three and we'll do a single crochet right into that. So we have four. So four on this side, four on this side, it's all even. And now we have one more row we're gonna do in our repeat. So we're gonna do row seven now. So chain one, turn. We're gonna work a single crochet in the first and the second. And then we're gonna chain three And now we need to set up our shells again. So we're doing them in the chain fives. So one, two, three, four, five. So there's the third chain right here that we're doing our double. Chain three, one, two, three. And our double, one, two, three. And then we're skipping over two single crochets and we're doing three singles. And then one, two, three. And in the third chain of the chain five, so one, two, three, one, two, three, we're doing a double. chain three and a double 
chain three. And then we end the same as we start with a single crochet in the last two. 